Hello, students. How are you doing today? You're doing great. Outstanding. You're looking for a job. Están buscando empleo. And you live in the United States. Or your interview will be in English. Tu entrevista será en inglés. What are they going to ask you? ¿Qué crees que te van a preguntar? Let's analyze or let's go over some of the most common interview questions. Vamos a ver algunas de las preguntas más comunes en una entrevista de, de trabajo. The number one question is, tell me about yourself. They always ask this. Tell me a little bit about yourself. Háblame acerca de ti. They want to know about your education, professional background. ¿Quieren que hables de ellos? ¿Quieren que hables de ti, disculpa, de una forma profesional, acerca de tu educación y de tu experiencia de trabajo? Another question is, why do you want to work for us? Why do you want to work for us? ¿Por qué te gustaría trabajar para nosotros? Only you know the answer. Why do you want to work for us? Another question is, what do you know about our company? What do you know about our company? ¿Qué sabes acerca de nuestra empresa o nuestra compañía? Another question is, why did you, why did you leave your last job? Why did you leave your last job? ¿Por qué dejaste tu último empleo? Oh, that's a difficult one. Esa es una difícil. Why did you leave your last job? Tell me about your experience at your last job. Tell me about your experience. Háblame acerca de tu experiencia en tu último empleo. Tell me about your experience. And depending on the job position you're applying for, They're going to ask you, what experience do you have in, in this job position? What experience do you have in this position? ¿Qué experiencia tienes en este puesto? Ah, here's another question that they love to ask. What are your strengths? ¿Cuáles son tus, eh, tus características fuertes o positivas? What are your strengths? Always, now remember here, in our last class, we talked about uh, abilities, And we talked about qualities. So here they want to know about your qualities. Cuando te preguntan, what are your strengths? Tell me about your strengths. They quieren que hables de sus cualidades. Okay? What salary range are you looking for? What salary range are you looking for? 
¿Cuál es el rango de ingresos que tú estás buscando? What salary range are you looking for? Be careful with this one. Don't go too low. You need to bargain. Go, go up a little and see what they offer. Here's another one. Tell me about a time when you had to take initiative. Háblame de alguna vez que tuviste que tomar la iniciativa. Tell me about a time when you had to take initiative. Tell me about a time you had to deal with a difficult customer. Háblame de alguna vez que tuviste que tratar a un cliente difícil. Tell me about a time you had to deal with a difficult customer. Tell me about a time you had to respond to a crisis. Yeah. Háblame de, de alguna vez que tuviste que responder por una crisis. And in this one, don't say you don't have any questions. Do you have any questions for me? Do you have any questions for me? En esta, no digas que no tienes ninguna pregunta. No te digan, do you have any questions for me? ¿Tienes alguna pregunta para mí? Very well. Okay. Now, these are just some of many interview questions. But practice the answers to these questions. I will ask you to write them below. Write them down below in the, in the comment box. Today you will learn how to talk about yourself. If you are preparing for an interview, you need to learn how to talk about yourself. And you need to learn to talk about job skills and qualifications. And about personal qualities. Personal qualities. Let's review what is a job skill or a job qualification. Degrees. Degrees is your education. Do you have a high school diploma? Do you have an associate's degree? Two years of college? Do you have a major? A major? It's usually four years of college. Do you have a master's? It's usually, uh, what, uh, five to up to eight years of college. Or do you have a PhD, a doctorate, depending on, on the major, right? It's the length of the master's or the PhD. So this is your college education and specialized training. Do you have, maybe you don't have college education. You have a high school diploma, but you have uh, specialized training in certain things. Maybe you have a hazmat. You were trained to transport hazardous materials. Or maybe you are a certified welder. A welder. Okay? You're a certified welder. That's specialized training. Okay? And Work experience. You need to learn uh, to talk about your work experience. How long have you worked in a company doing a specific thing? How long have you worked as uh, as a doctor, as a nurse, as a what, as a teacher? That's your work experience and. When we talk about qualifications and job skills, work skills. Work skills are languages. Can you speak different languages? 
Some jobs require that you speak different languages, or speaking languages can mean the difference between getting hired or not. Manage, for example, to be able to manage projects on your own. Can you manage a project on your own? That's a skill. Are you able to work well with others? That's a social skill. Okay? Can you fly an airplane? Oh, that skill may not be related to what you're doing, but if you can fly an airplane, always talk about it. Okay? Because it shows uh, other, it shows qualities in you. And when we talk about personal qualities, I want you to learn this vocabulary. Personal qualities, honest, honest, honesto, and the opposite, dishonest. Hard working, like me, to work very hard. The opposite, lazy. Reliable, reliable. Can we count on you to do the job? Are you reliable? Podemos depender de ti? Okay? Unreliable. Organized. Organized. Are you organized? Or disorganized? Do you do things in an orderly fashion? Okay? Punctual. Are you on time? Are you punctual? Or are you always tardy? Flexible. Are you flexible? Or are you not flexible? If you're not flexible, you can be brittle. I'll teach you that word later. Flexible. Patient. We need a lot of patience to... Uh, we need a lot of patience to, to deal or cope with a lot of things. We need patience, paciencia. Okay? So, these are skills. These are qualities. Skills and qualifications, qualities. So, when you go to an interview, learn to talk about your skills, and your qualities. Learn the vocabulary, and I'll see you. Any questions? Write them down there. Bye.